Avon Bottoms. Some say it's haunted. I've lived here for 70 years and haven't heard one thing. Others beg to differ. Today, I'm gonna see if that's true. They say they're swamp monsters, ghosts, and even werewolves. I don't believe in these things. But tonight, we're gonna find out. Okay, first clue for swamp monsters. There's tracks going up and down the ridge line right here. We're gonna follow them and see where they lead to. Okay, we just follow this trail back here to this woods. We think it was created by a swamp monster because it's so wide and the tracks are literally this big. They say the swamp monster is seven to eight feet tall with marsh and swamp bushes on it with six toes on one foot. I think right here is a perfect spot for a swamp monster to sit because there's a brush pile back here. It's next to a prairie we see going this way and there's a large body of water back here. I think this will be a great place for a night investigation. You know, I was actually kind of happy that this swamp monster actually made transfers. Whoa, what was that? What was that? What was that? I just ran off the woods. You gotta go get, get, get it. Okay, we're out here in the Avon Bottoms right now. Can't really tell, but... I definitely think there's something out here. Though. There is definitely a swamp monster in these woods. You know, it's, uh, it's said that Swamp monsters actually are more prevalent at nighttime when it's snowing outside. Okay, I think this is where something or someone was walking through. I don't think it's a swamp monster, but that sound was unexplainable. Okay, it's it's not supposed to be out here. Okay, it's either a it's either a Sasquatch, a ghost, or a swamp monster. 